So if you just turn this switch around, so you pull it towards you. Yeah, and then see the start button there? And there's another one here if you press the two of them together. And that's how easy it is to start the bus, okay? At the moment, it's only about 6.1% of all the drivers are female. Recruitment is open to everybody, but we have this set up for mom and all, trying to get more females into the company. Okay, so this button here is going to shut the doors, okay? We're going to have a little spin around. So you're in control of this vehicle, it's not controlling you. We're going to have a drive around uh, Broadstone with the depot, and then if she wants to do a little bit of reverse, then we'll go down to the reverse way. And by the time she leaves here, she's going to want to sign up with Dublin Bus. Start pulling the steering wheel around. That's enough, you don't need to oversteer it there, that's fine. And it starts fixing it, so start straightening it up there. It's not as heavy as I thought it would it's be. It's very though. easy to drive. It's yeah. very easy to drive. You, all you kind of need to do is get, if you're using your mirrors and get used to the mirrors, that will tell you. So you can see that mirror there and yeah. the mirror there. Okay. Yes. So if you can see the lines between that, so you can see the broken white lines on that side. Yeah. And you can see the yellow lines in there. Yeah. So that's telling you now that you're in the center of your road. Bring the bus to a stop. Right down on your brakes. Oh, and if you just, sorry. You're okay, so just go again, right down, and, um, and you stop the bus, fully stop it, so keep your foot right down on the brake, and you pull your handbrake back down. Now that's you stopped, and, and the handbrake is holding the bus there now. Again, as soon as you release the handbrake, yeah. it's going to start moving. Okay. So what you need to do now is just check your mirrors before you move off, and make sure that everything's okay, you can see that you're clear to go. Okay. And when you Once you kind of start going, you realise it's actually very similar to driving a car. It's not heavy, it's much lighter to manoeuvre than you'd envisage. I guess the biggest difficulty is the pure length of it. So going right around a corner, not that difficult. Going left around a corner, however, very difficult because you kind of forget that the back of the bus is going to clip unless you kind of turn late enough and turn wide enough. But overall, not as terrifying as I thought it would be. It's very different driving here in like a depot compared to out on the streets as well. You know, not only do you have people on the bus, but then you also have people around you, cars, vehicles, and obviously that's a lot more stressful, but then you do have people whose safety you're responsible for. So I guess there is kind of a pressure associated with that, but I picked up the basics there in about 20 minutes. So if you're doing training for six weeks, you know, that should be second nature, the driving aspect to it. So there you're able to concentrate more on other people and, and their safety. And realistically, once you're trained, it should be no bother to you.